Will do. On it. Halt! Keep both hands afore you and back away. Slowly. So you says. To be safe, I'll just... Found something. My fingers be fat and furry. But they're ever easy breezy, wet and sleek. Oi, done and done. Production's too slow. At this rate, we'll never get out of here. Not till LDs comes back. Hey, scamper off you. We ain't taking orders. Plus, if your armor's dented, you'd be better served throwing it against some rocks. For the record, I have no idea what I'm doing. Me and Brutal Ben had a bit of a disagreement. He tossed most of my crew into the brig. Myself and my first mate got the mercy of serving an extended stint in this forge. If you were one of us, you'd have heard that by now. Gossip flows like water through these parts. Tell me then, stranger, who are you? Blast my eyes and burn my fingers. I know you. Benwith attacked your ship right in the eye of a typhoon. He's been crowing about it enough since. Black Seas. But I hate Benwith. Me and Benny were real good mates in the Navy. But then he went and got too big for his britches. Playing second fiddle to Aldi's. I might have had too much to drink one night. That might have led to things being said and done I now regret. One of these days, he's gonna rue that brutal streak of his. The thought has crossed my mind. But it ain't just me I've gotta worry about. Ben's like my crew in the brig. I can't risk lashing out until I know they're safe. 
If you were to free them without creating much fuss, I could show you a secret route into Captain Aldi's quarters, where Ben was staying. They better fucking be. No matter how pissed he is with a single captain, killing an entire crew would rub Aldi's the wrong way. And he doesn't want to be on our bad side. Ben's locked him in the brig, down in the dungeons. Bail him out without making a bloody mess of it. Or it'll be my throat that gets slit. I don't know if these are any good seeing as I forged them, but here's a few lockpicks to help you out. If that fails, the keys ought to be on the jailer or by her post, a room between the brig and the dog kennels. The brig's got our best cells, you know. That's where we keep the ransom prisoners, the ones who ain't supposed to die. Finding them ain't hard. First, take these stairs in the back down to the dungeons, then cross the bridge to the storage room, then head south. You'll find the brig cells on the southeast side. Keep an eye out for guards. The dungeons are barred to all but Benwith's crew currently. You can use this to cut through the storage room. Just don't let anyone find out I gave it to you. My fingers be fat and furry. Aye. A light's foot and an heavy bullet, I cap. This here must be the brig. I don't be supposing we can swap in spark. Hello, Swabby. You ain't one of Benny's. What are you doing here? Knew we could count on our captain. Always looking out for us, he is. Seeing as you've let us out of the brig, I'd say we owe you. So you ought to speak with our captain in the forge. It's up the stairs on the western end. Keep it quiet and follow me, mates.
Nope. Be that you? Still alive and kicking, I see. You've done right by me, freeing my crew. So I'll divvy up what I promised. Doors open, but there's something you ought to consider before you go. Sure, you could traipse right up there into Aldi's quarters to gut Ben with, but he'll be heavily guarded. Meanwhile, me and my crew will be stealing Ben's ship, the Drake, and in doing it, we're gonna bait him into storming outside all alone. <laughs> no better way for it. Benny docks the Drake in a hidden berth beneath the fort. Kill the guards there for us. Aye, that's why I want your help. After you've cleared the docks, take the western tower to the fort's ramparts and sound the boating bell. Three rings. Me and my mates will sail out with the Drake. Three bell tolls alerts the fort to a ship leaving the private docks. With Aldi's gone to sea, that leaves just Ben's Drake docked. Been sure to storm the ramparts in a rage, right in time to watch his pride be stolen. The ones on the dock will be sitting ducks for your blade. If that's not incentive enough, do it to piss Ben off before you end him. Gods know I'm dying to. I can't wait until Ben gets his. I don't be supposing we could uh, blow it up. Swapped in spark. I've got it. Now what have we got here? I do believe I'll recognize these God's damn chest. By Andra's salty bosom. Romaro hauled this chest from one end of the dead fire to the other. Dear X, <laughs> that be me. I knew you'd seek me out. Please abandon the trail here. I've fashioned this predicament for my own, and I'd not have you lock its weight round your own ankles. If you find yourself imperiled, seek Udina at Magic Water. She can help. Aye, there'd be a word or two more, but uh, nothing useful to us. I don't know Udina from Wardmange, but Magic Waters, I know like my own fucking name. When I were a wee lad, fresh on the Sorcerer, Romaro would treat me to the luminous bathhouse at Nekitaka. Ah, oh, the water there shimmered like dawn on the open sea, and I, <laughs> full flush with the poetic creativity of youth, called it Magic Waters. I know you don't owe me the favour, Captain, but if we could find our way to that bathhouse, I'd not hold it against you. Unless, of course, uh, you asked. I wouldn't turn down and dip in the baths, but everything else you said is just awful. Uh, for now, though, we've got plunder and pillage before us, I. I don't be supposing we can easy breezy, wet and sleazy. Worth a look. <laughs> On it.
Captain? A light's foot and an heavy bullet, I cap. Ahoy, ahoy, from the Lord's foot and an heavy bullet, I cap. What for, Cap? Done and done. Now, lovesome, I know you know that Ben Weff can't know how you've come up here. Twice now, you don't want to be speared like a shark. You'd best be backing down nice and slow. Bloody pox piss, you mutinous lads. Get bolder and bolder, don't you? Bit of lead in your belly ought to settle you right down. Ready to Take ah! him down. That's going to cause a ruckus. I've got it. My back's about... I'm listening. You were saying? Could be a... My back's about broke as it is. <laughs> Fingers be fat and furry, easy breezy wet. Let's go, afraid not, bad. Captain. Who are you? And what are you doing here? Only Benwith's crew has access to my kitchens. Not that I care, really. Speak up so I can hear you. 
You won't find him in the kitchens ever. He's iron mighty, gold bricking in Captain Aldi's quarters now. These stairs go back to the court. It's the tower adjacent to this one that leads to Aldi's quarters. Think I want to tattle on you? What do I care if you're looking to hang yourself? Sneak around enough where you ain't supposed to, Benwith will catch ya. Carve you into chunks for my stew. Got a spot of blood on you, mate. I take it it all's going to plan. Me and my crew will be taking the drake now, then. Head on to the western ramparts and sound the signal. On it. <laughs> 